Good morning, family. Good morning, morning, morning. Ready for an exciting uh, day? We the, have this big day in front of us. In the mad city. That's, uh, we're gonna learn much about the history of Tanzania, the history, first Tanganyika and then Tanzania. We starting, I was, I was discussing with the guy, <coughs> with our driver, he said we'll start with the National Museum. So we'll drive, it's supposed to be like five minutes drive from here okay. to the place we're going to. <laughs> five minutes. Perfect. If you remember last night leaving the restaurant, getting back here takes us 12 minutes. Well organized location. I was watching time, 12 <laughs> minutes from there to here. But getting there, it was like half an hour. It's because of the traffic. Dar es Salaam is a big city. So we'll go to the National Museum while they are doing all the years. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> all right, that was a close call. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Yeah. That's just to wake up everywhere. We are up now. Uh, so, um, well, I'll try to make everything go smooth. So I will let you go on with the information and then I'll do the payment and by the time, I'm sure, by the time everything is been settled, we will be done with the visit. And thereafter, we we'll may pass on the way the art gallery. Art gallery is more about people working, painting, so we can pass there. And thereafter, we go to the uh, village museum. I'm, I'm more focused in these two big museums, not like the other small. The Kariako market, the, the local market, as I said, if it fits in our uh, in our plan, then we can uh, stop there, visit and see how it goes, and please let us stay together when we are there. If you get lost, uh, we'll scream your name. <laughs> then you hear everyone is screaming your name. Come on, come on, come on. Finally, I'm sure we'll find it. Ah, you see the downpour is raining so hard on the other side. So, after all the, the visit, we'll stop. In between, we'll stop at one of the restaurants. There's one called the break point. So it's a break and then a point. So we'll stop there, have lunch. It's a local lunch. Not as local as the village, the the village we visited. It's local halfway to modern. <laughs> so after lunch, we'll proceed with our day, get back to the hotel. I'm not thinking to get later than 4.35, between 4.30 and 5, so that you can enjoy a little bit the sea view and uh, uh, life at that place. I don't know, Brother Bomani, if you have planned dinner somewhere or you're going to the same place. Um. I do have an Ethiopian restaurant um, that was recommended by one of our guests, uh, one of our repatriates. Uh, so I'll get the name for you. Uh, okay, we, can decide, we, can. We, we can make a decision. So let, I, I, I am always with you if you're going to the Ethiopian restaurant. <laughs> I'm always with you. Uh, <laughs> you can never go wrong, right? <laughs> so we'll work out that earlier, very early than, yes. than the, the way we have been doing so that we can go a little bit early. Maybe if we get back by, by 5, 4.35, then caught like 6.30 or 7, we leave the hotel, so that we have that half an hour of preparation from 7 to 7.30, and then 7.30, between 7.30 and 8, we'll have dinner, and then by 9, we'll all be back to the, to the hotel. I will may forget, as you know, that I'm also a human. For real? <laughs> so let me t tell you this ahead of time. Tomorrow we're going to Zanzibar. Very, and very. A very, very, very nice place to be. Very nice place. The stone town itself is like, to me, it's like being in a gold city. It has got a lot of historical background. So I'm, I'm looking forward to us to be in Zanzibar and enjoy the Zanzibar. As I said before, it's a Swahili city. People are relaxed. 
no hurry. If you have ever heard the word no hurry in Africa, is in this coastal region. Nobody's rushing. You remember those Jamaicans? <coughs> they are from Jamaica. They are living in, in Dar es Salaam. They are adapted to Dar es Salaam life. I was watching yesterday the way we order juice. Normally, if I'm the waiter, I will, I will make, I will make a piece of paper with blocks. I know block one, two, three, four, five. But they are exactly like my fellow Tanzanians who are. <laughs> In our restaurants, if you go to the restaurants, like the local, local restaurants, you order like, I say, rice with fish. Then somebody will come out with the plate and say, rice with fish? If you don't respond, somebody else will take it. <laughs> so I, I was very happy. First, because we reached, we, we reached, the, we get to the restaurant, it's all the black people. And they are enjoying it. Yeah. Nobody's like sitting there and feeling like, He's been caged. Everyone. I was very happy. Even if there was no dinner, I was already happy. So, uh, when we get to Zanzibar, if things go slow, do not be upset. Take the rhythm. Take the flow. We'll reach the hotel in Zanzibar. It's a nice beach. There we can start doing our life. And when we come back to the uh, stone town, expect to see a lot of people around. Some of people will not want to sell you anything, but they want to talk to you. Don't be hooked up. It's better we keep together as a group. If it is necessary for you to take your own way, then we'll make a plan to meet in a, a certain point. In Zanzibar, if time allows, if things goes well, I would like all of us to have lunch at a point known as six degrees south of the equator. Exactly where six degrees south of the equator is on the planet. In Zanzibar, that's where the line is. We'll stop there and have lunch. They have more of seafood, lots of different seafood. Um, then we need to be a little bit earlier there because everything is being prepared fresh from the scratch. So that's a little bit more of Zanzibar. I will give you more hints tomorrow. We are now at the National Museum. You see, I said it take maybe five minutes, but it's been more than a minute. Seven minutes and 50 Seven, seconds. Minutes. But this is not bad. We will uh, get to the reception. I will try to get somebody who will take you around. Um, and then I will do the payment. I don't want you to stand outside and waiting for me to finish with the payment. Uh, and then you can go in. If they will allow us, you can already start going in and then I will deal with the payment. Things that you don't need, you can leave here in the car. Our driver is staying here and the car is, can be locked all the time. <coughs> but you carry on that got your passport, your money, you can take it with you because you may come across something that you don't want to miss it money is in the car by the time you come to the car to pick the money and get back to where you want to buy somebody who already took it so please welcome and enjoy the visit if in case there is anything difficult let us know so that we can fix it before it gets too late There's water in the fridge. If anybody wants to have one bottle, please. Yes. Yes. 